Supreme Court nominee Amy Comey Barrett is answering questions today from lawmakers on Capitol Hill. It is the second day of her fast-track confirmation hearings. CBS 2's Skylar Henry has more now from Washington. Well, let me begin. Right out of the gate, California Senator Dianne Feinstein's first questions focused on Judge Amy Coney Barrett's views on abortion. Do you agree with Justice Scalia's view that Roe was wrongly decided? Senator, I completely understand why you are asking the question, but again, I can't pre-commit or say, yes, I'm going in with some agenda because I'm not. Democrats are also focused on the Affordable Care Act. The Supreme Court has an upcoming case about the law's future. President Trump has made it crystal clear. He's promised that his nominees would overturn the ACA. Let me be clear. I have made no commitment to anyone, not in this Senate, not over at the White House, about how I would decide any case. Senate Judiciary Chairman Lindsey Graham has scheduled a committee vote on Barrett's nomination for later this week, even before her hearings have wrapped up. I will do everything I can to make sure that you have a seat at the table. And that table is the Supreme Court. President Trump has said he wants Barrett on the bench in time for the election. Democrats say she should recuse herself from any high court ruling about the election. Justice Ginsburg, in explaining the way recusal works, said that it's always up to the individual justice, but it always involves consultation with the colleagues, with the other eight justices. So that's not a question that I could answer. So far, can you hold up what you've been referring to in answering our questions? Judge Barrett has been answering questions without the use of any notes. Skyler Henry, CBS News, Capitol Hill.